Hey everybody, welcome back. David Yon and Stunning Isolated Cloud Party here with another vinyl record haul. I mean, <laughs> some of you might have seen, and it was brought up in the very last live stream, mm -hmm. that we were at the flea market and she stumbled over another huge, like ridiculous huge record lot. And basically told the guy, you're not going to sell that. You're not selling that. <laughs> And he had to admit that I was right. Yeah, she was like, yeah, you, you go, what do you want for these? You're not going to sell them. <laughs> and he was like, well, yeah, yeah, you're right. I'm not. Because <laughs> he wasn't. I mean, he didn't even have them oh, displayed. I, um, they were under a, a, a table. Yeah. Some of them aren't in good shape. I mean, the, 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 the jackets, jackets, the jackets are not in good shape. Yeah. Um, but they are some good, and he said there's some really good records in there, but mm -hmm. I really don't feel like being bothered with it. I don't want to look it up. I don't want to do nothing. I don't want to be bothered. Yeah. Um. So we made an agreement on what was under the table, and then he was like, well, I got some more in the van, and I'm like, well, where's that? He was like, oh, it's right there. So I'm thinking he's going to bring out, like, one crate. He brings out, like, four more crates. <laughs> It's like just take them, yeah. Because um, and that we that's where we've often found our best deals on vinyl records and like comic lots and stuff. Mm -hmm. People that they know they might have something there, but they just don't want to be bothered. Yeah, you know, they just don't care. And they know they're not going to sell it onesie twosies yeah. because especially with vinyl records, a lot of times when we buy out these lots, the jackets are pitiful yeah and people don't want to even look at the record because the jacket looks so bad yeah it's the, as long as the record itself is fine who cares what the jacket look like yeah because we actually <laughs> i mean i don't care we actually play them and some of them even if the, j the jackets are a little worn are still actually surprisingly valuable yeah you know, you, you'd be shocked at, yeah. at some of the prices on these i mean some of them we've had to clean the records yeah and you know you sit you spray it down with some vinegar and you wipe it down and it plays and looks like new so we're going to go through them and this lot um about 99% of it is R&B and rap. We had two, well, we had two Led Zeppelins and one Styx record, yeah. and that was it. Um, everything else is is R&B, classic R&B from the 60s, 70s, 80s. The rap from um, the beginning, because you got, like, the Sugar Hill Gang in there, and all the way up to, like, the mid-90s. Or early yeah, more yeah. like early 90s. I yeah. saw some 91, 92 ish. Yeah. Something so like that. So yeah. that's what we're going to look at. So we'll get started. And we we'll had a, we had also, we have a whole crate full of um, vinyl records with no jackets. Yeah. And we have a stack of jackets with no records. We don't have that down here yet because we're still working with those, mm -hmm. we're trying to put them back where they belong. But we'll show you what was together, anyways. Yeah. Start with uh, Parliament. That's bizarre. <laughs> oh yeah, trombipulation from Parliament. And the, and the you know jacket has some wear, but again the vinyl record is in really great shape in there. This one right here is is Al Green. Let's stay together. Okay. By Al Green. Donna Summer, a love trilogy. Donna, <laughs> yeah. This one is Total Planets, and. I never I've, heard of Total Planets. I really don't know what this yeah, is. Yeah, I've heard Planets. Yeah, I've, I've got an album by them. It's got oh, the weird... name of the band is Planets, yeah. and the name of the record is Total. I think so, yeah. Oh, okay. if this is the one I'm thinking of, because I have Planets upstairs. It's a really... They're not bad. It's a. It, it totally feels 80s mm -hmm. when you listen to it, but it's not bad. The Spinners. Yeah, I got that one already. The Spinners, yeah. Mm -hmm. I love The Spinners. Okay. I like The Spinners. <laughs> and the soundtrack to, to Roots. The original version. <laughs> it's only one Roots. No, well, they, they had it. some spinoffs. Yeah, yeah. They did have some spinoffs. Queen, Roots, the next chapter. Uh-huh. All kind oh, of weirdness. Oh, I thought they remade it recently. The original version. Oh, they remade it? I believe so. I don't I know why so. the original one was fine. Some stuff don't need to be redone. Yeah, it needs to right. be left alone. Linda Ronstadt. I, by now, I got about every Linda Ronstadt album yeah. just from getting them in lots. This is greatest 
hits, greatest hits, yeah. Carla Blay, whoever that is. Uh huh. It with says, Steve Swallow. Swallow on bass. Is that how he got the job? Oh no! On bass. <laughs> on bass. Uh huh. Ah, uh -huh. the Jackson's Destiny album. Yeah. Remember the Jackson's? Open it up. Is that the one with their pictures in there? Yeah. Oh, yes. Yeah, open it. Let people Take see. Take a look at Michael's fro. <laughs> he looked like a bell. God, I know. <laughs> He's <laughs> a mushroom. He should be in the Smurf Village. But that was back before he started uh, messing with his face. Yeah, before all of the... Uh, Reconstruction he surgery. He wasn't a bad looking guy. I don't know why he did skin that. Skin lightener. Yeah. Uh, Earth, wind, and fire spirit. Uh huh. And see, like this one, jacket's all messed up, but the record is in a Good great shape. shape. So you know, you can't always look at that. It's the new Zap. Oh, that's Zap featuring Roger Troutman. Uh huh. Zap. Stanley. Turn, turn, what? Turn Turrentine. No, whatever. Turrentine, Turrentine. Yeah. Everybody come out. Yeah. Everybody come out. Go ahead. Oh. Yeah. Blackbird. Donald Blackbird. BT Express. Do it. Do it till you're satisfied. Yes, sir. This house is smoking. That's what I want for you, baby. The, what is all that you're talking about? I'm reading the names of the songs. Oh. Look at this. You know what happens when you have that many members in a band? No money, because you're always fighting. <laughs> this is Miles Davis. Uh-huh. Slave. Slave. Mm-hmm. I got a couple of Dave records. Yeah. Box <laughs> Beyond Ordinary <laughs> Existence. This is low okay. down. Okay. A real G. Okay. And low down. Yeah, a real G. Yeah. That's me. I guess. Natalie Cole, don't look back. I'm warning you. Don't do it. Don't look back. Billy Paul. He's the one that sang um me and Mrs. Jones. Uh, no, no, no. Yeah, 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 I think so. He's the one that sang Me and Mrs. Jones, I believe. It's the only song he had that was any good. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm. I actually got that. It was an inappropriate song, anyways. <laughs> Cheating. Shame on you. What's this? KMD. Oh. Peach Fuzz. I see. Why? Because they all young? I guess. A Show the gas picture on the back. Fill, gas face refill. Whatever uh -huh. that see means. How, see how young they are. Uh -huh. What is the banner for? No nappy hairdos? I guess. I just, yes. <laughs> that's a mess. The OJ's family reunion. Oh, yeah. That's yeah. a good one. Family reunion. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Third World. That's that reggae group. Okay. Who is this? Grover Washington Jr.? Uh-huh. Swimming, he looked uh, naked. Uh, yeah, right he here. ain't wearing his trunks. Yeah, did he, he lose his trunks in the water? No, somebody he pants looked pretty, them. pretty naked. My favorite person by the OJs. Who, myself? It says my favorite person. Who is your favorite person? I don't know, yourself? it doesn't say. I guess you have to listen to the record. BB King, guess who? Oh, Grover Washington Jr. again. Live at the Bayou. Uh-huh. At least he got clothes on this time. And uh, oh. Michael Frank's One Bad Habit. What is the bad habit? Because, you know, all I see is like a can of tennis balls and maracas hanging in there. What's the bad habit? I don't know. He, there is somebody hiding in the locker, though, mm -hmm. I see. See? The Gap Band. Oh, you see, she missed it. Oh, she got a gap. She got a gap. Yeah, I see. Is that the kind of gap they were talking about? I don't know. I don't know either. That's gap what they band got. was actually pretty good. Yeah, they were SOS band. Mm hmm. No one's going to love you. Nobody. Mm hmm. I'm warning you. Go. Oh, go, go ahead. ahead. George Handy. I never heard of him, so I don't know what this is about. 
but we'll see. Groove Holmes American Pie. American Pie. Mm. That was a movie. Last message of Malcolm X. <laughs> <laughs> So it's a Malcolm X record. George Duke, master of the game. I like George Duke, but I bet you that don't have the song on it at Which all. Which song? Um, rhyme, no rhyme, no reason. Oh, I don't know. It doesn't look like it. Bob Marley. Oh, mm. and the Whalers. And the Whalers. That's right. You gotta make sure you hear them. They're gonna wail. Yeah, it's like the wailing women. Well, go ahead, because i got to figure out what this is. Okay, me too. Now, this is it's, it's the DJ copy, uh -huh. and it's not for resale. Um, let me see what, what it is. It's the Modern Jazz Piano Album, which I don't know what that means, because I don't like jazz, and I don't like instrumental, uh -huh. like, you know, just like music playing. <coughs> if it's the song and it's the instrumental, I'm okay with that. But just like, you know, I don't I don't think I'm gonna keep this one. But I gotta see. DSK sweat till you're wet. Oh boy. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> Roy Hampleton, you can have her. Yeah, she he had enough of her. Yeah. Sometimes you just gotta let a person go. Graham Central Station. Graham. Central I got another one of this. Get that suit. Isaac Hayes. Uh oh. Hot buttered soul. <laughs> <laughs> I got quite a bit of Isaac Hayes now, and I've been listening to him because now you can hear all of his stuff. He's actually really good. Yeah, and not that just same one or two songs over and over yeah, again. Yeah, and you're yeah. like. I'm I'm like surprised, and my mama had a lot of Isaac Hayes records. I took all hers. Oh, and uh, she don't need them. Um, <laughs> so, and I'm listening. You know, I wasn't expecting much. And I'm like, wow, this is actually pretty good. Yeah. Mhm. Mm Who is this? Uh, Chuck Brown and the Soul Searchers, busting loose. I'm busting loose. I think I know that. So Isaac oh, yeah. Hayes, Black Moses. That's a good one. Uh huh. Um, I have this one in the original jacket. It's a it's it's a real good uh record. He's pretty good and he's done some um covers that I was surprised how well it came out with his deep voice and how he yeah. really changed it up. Eddie Kendricks, he's a friend. Mm -hmm. That's all it is. That's all it is. Ohio Players, the um contradiction. And this is the original jacket because it was two. And this is the actual. Oh, that's all naked in there. This is the jacket for this because it's two. Uh huh. And this is the inner yes. sleeve. Chet Atkins workshop. I think he's a um, country singer, I believe. Isaac Hayes again. again. Hot bed. What is that on the, the back, back of his head? Uh -uh. That's not his head. That's his chest. Is it? Yeah. Oh, does it open out? I don't know. I think it does. Yeah, it opens out. Okay. Ohio players again. Fire. Uh-huh. Oh, you finished? No, go ahead. Oh, okay. No, you have more on your side. Than yeah, I do. I do. Um, wait, why? Well, I know to... well, Winton Marshall. Marsalis. Winton Marsalis. Okay. There you Black go. Codes. Winton Marsalis, Black Codes. I think he's a jazz singer too, so this is going to be all trumpet music. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I like that. Um, Granddaddy IU. Granddaddy IU. Another rap album. This is Ice T. Uh oh. Girls. L G B N A F. I'm sure that means something that's very, very nasty. So does this one. Okay. This is the last poets, and I can't even read most of these. Um, I can say black thighs. Oh yeah. You see, wake up, bad yeah. word, run, bad word. I can't. I can't even <laughs> read that on the air. 
<laughs> Superb. Born on parole. Yeah. Born on parole <laughs> in 90008. That's the zip code California. for Cub. Yeah, Los Angeles. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Big boy. Daddy Kane, it's hard being the Kane. Mm-hmm. Is it? Oh. Granddaddy IU, Sugar Free. Uh huh. Produced by Biz Markey. Okay. Okay. Speaking of which, Big Daddy Kane, it's a Big Daddy Thang. <laughs> and there's, a, there's a, a signature on this one. I don't know if it's actually his. You can't see it because it's in black, but this is signed. Big Daddy Kane. Yep, that's what I'm talking about. Names. Get off of there and quit scratching that up. Move and go sit down somewhere. Scoob Lover. Mr. C. Oh, these are the names Scrap Lover and Big Daddy Kane. I guess that's the na- their nicknames. <laughs> Shantae. <coughs> Big Mama. Uh-huh. Maybe she is. No, no, no. Average White Band. Soul Searching. I like Average White Band. Mm-hmm. Ghostface Killer. Uh, was that Cam A? Yeah. And Daytona. Yeah. Uh huh. I looked that one up. That's not like a cheap one either. Yeah, and it's like of three of them. Run DMC, Back from Hell, uh-huh. featuring Chuck D and Ice, Ice Cube. Cube. Yeah, wow. Yeah, and this is another Ghost Ghostface Killer. Killer. We got two of them. Yeah. You know, DJs usually had two copies yes. of um, the record so they can mix them. Oh, Soul Train, the hits that made it happen. And there's a variety album here. Mm-hmm. So let's like see. Uh, Superfly, Why Can't We Live Together, I Gotcha, Leaving Me, Scorpio. All right. This is the Chocolate Jam Company for promotion only. Uh-huh. And it's the spread of the future. I see. George Benson, In Your Eyes. I don't know about this one right here. This is... um. M tomb. I don't know. In search of the rainbow seekers. It's kind of weird. Wow. Show the back. Yeah. <laughs> Those outfits. I tell you what. Chi Ali. Let the horns blow in funky lemonade. And this one is signed also. There's a signature on this one. Let's see. Mm-mm. And it's dated ninety two. B F M. I don't know what BFM is, yeah, it's, but it's the city of dope. <laughs> and they get the city side and the and dope, dope side. side. Yeah, because you got to flip it. <laughs> <laughs> now, these are rap. Because I did listen to rap in the 80s and 90s. I never heard of any of these uh, Yeah, people. well, there was a lot of them out there. They just yeah, didn't get far. Yeah, it was. Far. Yeah, they didn't get far. And this is that Two Live Crew album I was telling Explicit. you about. Explicit. Yeah, and you can see some of the words then. Yeah. I ain't going to read those. But, yeah, this is um, Two Live Crew when they were with Luke. Luther Campbell. Marvin Gaye, here, my dear. Yeah, that's a weird one. Who is this? Sweet G, a heartbeat rap. Uh huh. By Sweet G. I don't know if you're a rapper, you want your name to be Sweet G. Ella Fitzgerald, the Gershwin songbook. This is another Big Daddy Kane. It's hard be. Oh, it's the same one, so it's two of these. Okay. And then it's two of this superb with um, Born on Parole and um, 90008. Yeah. So it's two of those. Oh, Stevie Wonder song and songs in the key of life. It says, uh, you know, this is four, so there's a set somewhere. Yeah, all of them are there. Um, you know, they're in different jackets. Yeah. That's um, the Sticks album. Yes, yeah, Sticks, Borrow Time, Fast mm-hmm. Eddie, yeah. Mm-hmm. That's the Sticks. This is. Kalucha Dawn featuring the Fugees. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you know. 
It says Blue Magic, Major Harris, Marjorie Joseph, live. I like Blue Magic. This is Bobby Walmack. Jay-Z, A Million and One Questions. I don't think I really ever heard any Jay-Z songs Rock like all that. Rock A Fella Records. Telesis. And that's Time time for a Change. Uh -huh. This is that record that's pre... What's his name? Dr. Dre. Yes, it's... A, it's it's before he was Dr. Dre. Yeah. I don't know which one is him, but... Diabolical Biz Marquee. Biz Never Sleeps. Ohio Players again. Uh, Honey. Uh-huh. Leon Thomas Antol Anthology. Whoever he is. I don't know. This is the Isley Brothers oh, Showdown. Those outfits. Yeah. They look ridiculous. <laughs> And really, the belly shirt, that's necessary. <laughs> and he got it tied. <laughs> they look so uh, bad. Yeah. They really See, do. This guy. All of them, they're not in shape for those outfits at all. <laughs> that looks terrible. <laughs> Mariah Carey, heartbreaker. Main source, just hanging out. Uh-huh. Well, from the pictures on the back, it looks like they are. Yeah, just standing around on the corner. Yeah, that's what a lot of people do. Mm-hmm. Let's see, who is this? The Temptations, oh. 1990. Destiny's Child, Bugaboo. Oof, a stupid song with a is stupid it? band. The <laughs> Temptations, 1990. This is the jacket. The four, so I got two, two of these. Temptations, 1990. The Whispers. I like the Whispers. So good. They're so good. Lloyd Loving Deer with Shabaranks. Oh. I like Shabaranks. George Clinton, R&B Skeletons in the Closet. Oh, you know what? On the back, they got like some games and stuff. Yeah. Show it. This one right here is, is a lot of fun. I did that one. Oh. Mm-hmm. It's pretty funny. Uh, Marvin Gaye, let's get it on. Uh huh. Bill Withers live at Carnegie Hall. This one is David Oliver, Mind Over Magic. Oh, <laughs> Mind Magic. <laughs> I don't know where I get over from. Bill Withers is still Bill, so don't get it mixed up. Not Kill Bill, still Bill. This is George Cranes. Mm, look at this. It's somebody, not the two light crew. Somebody scribbled on it. Yeah. It wrote all on it and crayon on both sides. <laughs> like, what yeah. is that about? Teddy Benegrass, uh, this one's for you. Yeah. I've about got all of the Teddy Pendergrass. Superfly now. soundtrack? Mm-hmm. <laughs> that movie was stupid. I got this one, too. That's one of those Curtis movies that's Mayfield. fun to watch because it's stupid. Chic. Sheik is a uh, Sheik, Sheik was Sheik. good. Yeah, Sheik was a good band, and it's, they got some good. They got some nice tracks. Grandmaster Melly Mel, White Lines. Oh yeah, that's a classic. Mm-hmm. There's another copy of Roots there. Yeah, I don't know why you need two copies of Roots. K Solo, Leatherman, Letterman. I remember the name K Solo. Uh -huh. I don't really remember anything that he did. Roberta Flack, first take. The Shy Lights. I wish this was the older Shy Lights. I like the Shy Lights. Mm -hmm. They were pretty good. Natalie Cole, I love you so. Mm -hmm. Got a lot of Natalie Cole, too. I see. She all right. She starts screaming after a while, uh -huh. though. So getting kind of kind of too much. Um, Iron Man, Ghostface Killer. This the whole album uh, instead of just the uh, tracks. singles. Yeah. yeah, so I got two singles and then the whole thing. The Message is Love by Barry White. Mm-hmm. Jeffrey Osborne. I like Jeffrey Osborne. He's pretty good. Mm -hmm. So, as you can see, this guy really did have some yeah. good records. He just didn't want to be bothered. Now, somebody just wrote all Roy over Roy Ayers, Let's Do It. I don't know. He's, he stole that from the Macho Man, by the way. Look at this outfit. Randy Savage should be wearing this. See? <laughs> this person just wrote all over this, this one. This is too short. 
Born to Mac. Yeah, that's right. You got to get your Mac on. I guess. Yeah. I don't know what happened to Too Short. It just kind of disappeared. Uh-huh. They were too short. You couldn't find them. Yeah. Moving Target by Gil Scott Herring. And that's a foreign copy. That's yeah. A, that's a UK But on the copy. back, he looked like an action figure. Don't he look like a G.I. Joe figure? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That doesn't look <laughs> like a real person. I mean, <laughs> he kind of looks oh, like an no. action figure. Michael Jackson's You've Gotta Be There. Got to be there. See, look at that. Now, see how good looking he was. Yeah, he wasn't a he bad was looking a guy. He just guy. he had self esteem issues. Yeah, he really did. He did not think he was a good looking person. He was very good looking. Then he started doing the nose and the chin and lightening up his skin color and all that. And then he, that's when he really got messed up. Another Parliament record. Mm -hmm. And he look all crazy on the back. This is Aretha. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, Aretha. Who's Franklin. zooming? Who? That's a very 80s looking mm. uh, album cover. Because that song came out in the 80s. Did it? Yeah. Toss It Up. Yeah. Toss It Up. Mm-hmm. Jiggy. Yeah. Jiggy Toss I It Up. I about got all the uh, Aretha Franklin records, too. I'm going to send that right on down to Google. Oh. Because I don't like Aretha Franklin. Brick. S too hot. Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. Go ahead. You ain't even ready. I am, because there's a lot going on here. It's the suckers need bodyguards, self-destruction, stop the violence movement. Oh, yeah, self-destruction. That yeah, this is a jacket. Self-destruction, mm -hmm. yeah. George Benson, in flight. Yeah, self-destruction um, was uh -huh. a good was a good song. I like that song. Freedom, Grandmaster Flash. Oh, yeah. Sugar Hill Records. The best of Lonnie Liss Liston Smith. Uh-huh. <clears throat> oh, yeah. De La Soul, Ring Ring. De La Soul. I, I like De La Soul. I know. Oh, 20 Years of Motown. So there's a bunch of Motown songs uh -huh. that go back. It's a, a two-record uh, album. CBS Laboratories Technical Series. What is that? Oh, that's the test record. Yeah, it is. And actually, um, not to be overlooked, when you go to Goodwill or something, you're digging through the records, stuff like this, it sells. It, it A lot of people that still have old hi-fi systems and stuff, it, it has all these tones on it and a voice that tells you what level the tone is at so that you can dial everything in perfectly. And that the, they, they do go for quite a bit sometimes. Another slave record? Mm-hmm. Visions, Perfect Day. Mm -hmm. This is Get Ready, The Rare Earth. Yeah. So I dig through. Pat Garrett and Billy the Kid. Uh-huh. I don't know what that's all about. <laughs> There's a pretty dynamic looking back uh, cover there. Yeah. Bob Dylan soundtrack. That's what it says on the front. Charlie Bird, Christmas Carol, uh, carols for solo guitar. Yeah, they can go right on in there. I don't want that box. Oh. Grover Washington Jr., we keep on going. I'm going to have all of his records, yeah. too. A lot of them. Soundtrack from The Sing. From The Sting, rather. Yeah, with Sting. Robert Redford. Robert Redford. Midnight Star. Standing together. Look at them outfits. I know. Look at all them weird outfits. And then they looking across at something. <laughs> Johnny Guitar Watson. Mm -hmm. Funk beyond the call of duty. And then he on top of the... Um, <laughs> he took those shots in front of the VA and ran off. The um, veteran, the VFW. Yeah, I know. That's what oh, I'm the saying. Legion Hall. Yeah. Ohio players again. A lot of Ohio players, which I'm not mad about because I like sure. Ohio players. Yeah. I like it if you got a lot of a good band. BT Express again. Oh, it's so two of them. Those, yeah. O'Brien doing all right. Not O'Brien from Star Trek The Next Generation. Mm -hmm, this guy. I just want to point that out. He doing all right. Dalton and Dubari. Choice. What kind of choice are you making, boys? Dalton and Dubari. What's the choice? Is it a choice to work on that hairline? Because that looks kind of high. <laughs> Super bad is back. Oh. Super bad is back. 
Aretha Franklin, Amazing Grace. Yeah, she can go right on too. <laughs> Life on the Streets by MC Crash and the Beauty and the Beat Posse. Beauty and the Beat Posse. Mm, dumb. <laughs> oh, that's very 80s. That's very <laughs> Beauty and the Beat Posse. It's like, <laughs> you couldn't come up with nothing else. Casey and the Sunshine Band, Do You Want to Go Party? I love Casey. Special Ed, Youngest in Charge. He was um, cool. He had that song, I've Got It Made. And this is the whole album, not just a single, so that's pretty cool. I'm glad about that. Donald Byrd, Street Lady. Mm, she a street walker. Is she? Chub Rock, not the, treat him right, Chub Rock. The Chubster. Yeah. The Chubster. <laughs> What what a brother know? What do they know? I don't know. I don't know either. I guess you have to listen to the album. Yeah, to find out. Yeah, find out. What Style. Style. And then they got like the upside down male symbol. There's a signature on there too. Yeah. But see how the male signal symbol yes. is all upside down? I don't know what that means. It's supposed to be at an angle. Mm -hmm. The Little Soldier. It's a kitty record. Oh, they colored it Somebody up scribbled too. on the back. Bobby Walmack safety zone. I'll put some of these down. Mm-hmm. Yeah, these usually run a little long. Yeah. Because we have so much. And and we like I said, all the loose ones we didn't even show. No. Stevie Wonder, hotter in July. Uh-huh. Stevie Wonder is pretty good. Um Yes. And and it's usually like the whole record is pretty good when it comes to Stevie Wonder. All the way up until the eighties. And yeah, he, he started kind of dropping he off. Ran, a he little ran bit. out of uh, steam, I guess, which, you know. A lot of people it's do. Yeah. Especially when he got to, um, what's the one? J Jungle Fever. Oh, that was trash. Uh, that song, I don't know about that. It's like, see, see how many times you can say it's Jungle Fever? Basically, because there's no lyrics to it. It's just repeating the same line over and over. Roxanne Shantae, I'm Fly Shantae. Oh, is she? That's what she saying. Oh, okay. And this is who do you want to get funky with me? Peter Brown. Okay. Let me see what we got. Here's another one never to overlook. I should do a short on this stuff. Halloween horrors. <laughs> never overlook uh, weird oddities like this or, or like creepy music sounds and things like that. Das Effects. Straight out the sewer. <laughs> And hard like a criminal. Okay. So I don't know what straight out. That might can go with a Ninja Turtle thing. Straight out the sewer. Millie Jackson feeling bitchy. Yeah, she can get kind of raunchy on you. Uh-huh. Yeah, be careful with her. But I got one. She didn't do all that. And it was pretty good. Um, Big Daddy Kane, I'll Take You There. Remix. Oh. And again, these are clean. Mm -hmm. These are oh, these are clean, and that's what we care about. Go oh. ahead. Teddy Pendergrass. Mm -hmm. Cause I'm gonna have every ten, Teddy Pendergrass record. Main started. ingredient: rolling down a mountainside. Oh yeah. Brass construction. That's a big band. Yeah. What's with the guy with the Princess Leia hair? Where? Well, the. <laughs> This one, it looks like he's got buns on the sides, like, <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Princess Leia. Marvin Gaye, <laughs> Trouble Man. Uh-huh. Oh, that's from a movie, isn't it? Soundtrack? Yeah, it is the yeah. soundtrack. Minnie Ripperton, Adventures in Paradise. This is who? Who, who, me? I'm not with him by Richard, Richard Pryor. Pryor. Yeah. So this is a comedy. Yes, very likely. And he gonna be all vulgar. He could be very vulgar in stand up. Yeah. That is true. The good old James oh, Brown. Yeah. This is the one with um Living in America on mm -hmm. it. He's better in concert. Yeah. You gotta it's one of those things you, to really appreciate him, you gotta see him in concert. Yeah. It's much better than the vinyl. Just um, go ahead. No, go ahead. I can just show it. Same as uh, Elvis is yeah. Isaac Hayes chocolate chip. I'll mm -hmm. take a cookie. Elvis is like that. Meatloaf is like that. Yeah. You see Meatloaf in concert versus just listening to the val the record is completely different. 
Yeah, and then also with James Brown. Ohio players skin tight. You have to listen to the live version because yeah. he does have the <laughs> studio version, which is short. It's usually like two minutes. <laughs> But you get to that live version and you see him perform it, it's like, oh my God, this dude, you can see why they say he's the hardest working man in um, showbiz. Donna Summer, another Donna Summer. Uh -huh. Go ahead. Craig G, play it and say it. Craig G, get enough, uh, I guess that is his whole crew there. And that's why he and has he no got to pay every one of yeah, them. Yeah, that's why he's getting no money. <laughs> Another Isaac Hayes to be continued. Uh huh. I'm not gonna even say I'll just show the record. <laughs> She's not a fan. <laughs> yeah, I mean I'm not. I'm, I'm not gonna dump on a woman. She did. She did her she thing. She did her thing. Yeah, and she was very popular. I'm. I just don't care for her singing. Yeah. Um, but then that's just me, and I have a right to like who I wanna like. Yeah. So. R&B Funkadelic, One Nation Under a Groove. Oh, yeah, now that's a good one. That's um, George Clinton. Yeah, and then look at the the artwork. It's awful. <laughs> what is up with that woman? Is that her hip on the front? Yeah, I guess she has supposed to have a big butt. I don't know. Mm. And then they got all this going on in here. It's like in a, the inside? Yeah. Oh, yeah. There's like a whole comic strip in there. It's badly drawn. Oh, no, yeah. And then this woman is naked. And it, it's her bust is very low. Oh yeah, I don't know what's up with that. It's yeah. kind of weird. Yeah, it's very weird. But they, I, they, they couldn't afford a. Uh, uh, couldn't afford a, an artist. Well, they got the guy, that one guy, that uh, yeah, I'll hook you up for a hundred dollars. Yeah, I, I, that's what they did. And his nephew. The OJ's, yeah. Who is this? First prior? Oh, MC Light. Okay. Poor, poor Georgie. And search and the light. Oh, search for. Sorry, search, search for, for the, the light. light. This is main source breaking, breaking atoms. By the main source breaking atoms. Are you finished? I, I I'm got a couple left. Go ahead. Chris Rock roll with the new, and there's two of them in there. Mm -hmm. So I guess this is his stand up. I actually like Chris Rock in stand up. I think he kind of funny. He vulgar, but I think he's funny and he says some stuff that's for real. Positively black. You can't get no blacker than them. I, I guess. guess not. You look. <laughs> I remember when people dressed like that for real. Yeah, with all them. African colors. And yeah. Like, and people in Africa. Don't uh, look at that. This. All the pendant. That's the biggest one I've ever seen. Remember the leather Africa pendant? <laughs> you remember those? Yeah. Ugh. I had one of those. Why you had one? Somebody of them? gave it to me. I never had one. Barry White. A co worker gave it to me. <laughs> what and was he trying to tell you? I don't know. He was black. <laughs> <laughs> but he ga he gave he gave that to me. I don't know why. <laughs> but yeah, it's about so big, leather with the with the cord. <laughs> Who is this? Um, Ramsey Lewis, Funky Serenity. Yeah. Whatever that means. You finished? I got one more. Oh, here let me give you a couple. <clears throat> you give me a couple. You mean like half? I still got okay. a bunch. Okay. Millie Jackson is caught up. Mm hmm Look at that fro. Wow. <coughs> Marvin Gaye, I want you. And that's from Good Times. Yeah. That art yeah, the, oh, the oh yeah, the whole front mm -hmm. there. That's that's the Good that's Times that art artist. that JJ supposedly drew. drew. Yeah. <laughs> Harold Melvin and the Blue Notes. I love Harold Melvin and the Blue with Notes. Teddy but I got that. Mm hmm Lionel Richie. Uh-huh. She's my lady. Who's that? Oh, Brady Green Tate. Tate. Yeah. Who's this? Herbie Hancock. Oh. He's got some weird stuff in the 70s. Yeah. He's just a jazz player, though. He ain't uh, seen. Yeah. Uh, the Impressions uh -oh. with Jerry Butler. Donna Summer. She did a lot of stuff. 
Michael Henderson going places. Mm -hmm. Marvin Gaye. Yeah. Wake up, everybody. Harold Melvin and the Blue Notes. Wake up, everybody. Mm hmm. Ray Coleman and Brown. Oh, no. What? Oh, yeah. Ray Parker Jr., the other woman. I'm in love. Wow, he looks with 80s, the other though. Woman. Uh, he looks like he should be on an episode of Miami Vice right there. The mm -hmm. whole background, everything. Yeah. Very, very early 80s vibe. Enchantment. Uh huh. Enchantment was good. Brick. 60s, uh, 70s. Ain't movies. gonna hurt nobody. Ain't gonna hurt nobody. From Bang Records. Bang. That's right. Um, <coughs> this is the Miracles. Okay. When Smokey Robinson left. Powerful people. G uh, Gino Finelli. Yeah, I think that's going to end up in a... <laughs> you don't know. It might be really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't know who this is. Marlena Shaw. Yeah. And then, um... Gene Chandler, get down. Mm. Get down. War. Oh, yeah. <laughs> good God, y'all, buddy. That's not the I same know war. that the Isley that's Brothers the, sing huh. that song. But this is war. Ohio players again. The world is a ghetto. Is it? Yeah. Oh, that's that honey. I got two of those. Yeah. In flight with George Benson. Mm-hmm. This is the soundtrack to what movie? Let's do it again. Oh God, that was a stupid movie. <laughs> that was when uh, Sidney Poitier went from being an Oscar-winning actor to doing black exploitation films in the seventies. Rose Royce in full bloom. This is Patrice Roche in Forget Me Nots. Oh, GQ uh, Boogie Oogie Oogie and Boogie Nights. You know, Boogie Nights. No, they don't sing that. That's they don't? Heat Wave. Well, then. That's GQ? the number one. Okay, I don't know. Yeah. The Warriors motion picture the soundtrack. The Warriors. The Warriors. Oh, hold on. That's it's it's a record in there. Uh, is this there? is Joe Tex. Joe Tex spills the beans. Oh, Joe Tex is a rat. I guess so. You done? Yes. Are you done? Almost. Whoa. Michael Walden. Nardia. N Narada. I don't know. <laughs> White but, Knight, Guards yeah. of Love. This, uh, this song, look, I mean, especially, look at him in the front there. Uh huh. He don't look like he's singing nothing I want to hear. <laughs> but you know, you can't watch judge like, a watch book by like cover. This hardcore, like, trashy rap. <laughs> <laughs> Barry White. <laughs> Barry White, look at her. Mm, look at her do what? I don't know. Maybe it's inside here. No. What's that? Two more. Uh, oh. Quincy Jones, I heard that. Oh, yeah, and this is the cover for it. Uh-huh, got it mixed up. Bobby, no, it's two of them, that's all. Bobby Bland, members only. I like that song right there, oh, Bobby yeah. Blue Bland. That's it. Oh, that's it. Holy crap. Well, there you go. I know it went on for a minute. <laughs> that's uh, that's what happens when we do these. And again, this isn't all of it because we still have a whole crate full of, uh, full of like, loose vinyl and a whole yeah. crate full of... of uh, slip covers that we need to try to Put get together. together and hopefully they all match. Yeah. We found a few that do, but hopefully they all match. And that's what happens when you go to the flea market with LPH. And she comes back with a crap ton of vinyl records. It's okay. I love it too. <laughs> you know, um, Kane Unit uh, was making fun of me saying, now you're going to have to build another cabinet. Because, <laughs> you know, I, I built her a couple of record cabinets. But, we're, yeah, we probably are going to need another well, one. The two record cabinets that he built are full, and we still had, like, three of the big crates full. But I was just, like, not going to worry about it. But now we got these. <laughs> yeah, okay. So we probably can fill two more. Yeah. You know, with what didn't get in there, plus what we just got. Yeah, we probably can fill... It's okay. It's okay. Anything to make her But happy. I'm not buying no more records. 
That's what you said the last three times. I know. And then it's... Well, when a deal pops up, yeah. you know, if it's... Because I don't go out looking. Yeah. You know, we're at the flea market, at the yard sale or whatever, and somebody has them. And you then know, they practically give them away because they don't want to deal with it. Yeah. Or sometimes you just um, perusing through Facebook Marketplace and you'll see something and then you contact the person and they're like, yeah, I'll take a deal. How much? Is yeah, Facebook Marketplace still works. It hasn't gone full Craigslist yet. Yeah. Craigslist is completely worthless now. I don't even look on Craigslist no. anymore. No. Or um, offer up or let's go, let go, whatever. They merge together. But I used to um, go on there to look for stuff, offer up. But I don't do that and I don't look on Craigslist anymore. Yeah. But hey, there you go, guys. What do you think? Did we do all right? <laughs> Let us know what your thoughts are in the comment section down below. Anything in particular really catch your eye? We were like, "Wow, that's a great one." Tell us what. Tell us which one it is in the in the comment section. Again, you know, we're not really resellers like all that. We I, I have sold records before. We we got rid of a bunch at the last at the Conyers Toy yeah, Show. Yeah, because they were the duplicates. Like yeah. these, I'll go through, yeah. pick out the duplicates, and see if I have any. Like some of these, I know I have. Yeah. We'll pick those out. And then sell them. But and I was selling them like five for a buck. And people, are you serious? They're like, yeah, five for a dollar. Just <laughs> yeah, because yeah, I'm not trying them. to. I'm not trying to get over. No, but we just want to get yeah. rid of them. But yeah, again, let us know what your thoughts are. Please do give the video a thumbs up if you got something out of it. Share it if you can. Subscribe if you're new. All that good stuff. Check out some of the other content. And if that's it, then what more can we say? But thanks for watching, and we will see you again soon.